You give me everything I got going on But lately I've been feeling like you kind of drowning But I never could swim in your So Hey guys <laughs> I ain't gonna do none of that I'm <laughs> Over here trying to be like, hey guys, how y'all doing? Welcome to today's vlogging video. It's your girl. Whatever. I ain't doing all that shit today. I ain't got the time. So let's just hop right in. Hey, how you doing? If you didn't know me, now you know me now. My name is Monique. AKA I got. And um I'm a model. Slash I'm an entertainer, period. I, I can't entertain you. <laughs> Cause I was gonna say slash what? Like I'm, I'm a jack of all trades, so can't really put myself in a specific category when I qualify for all. Okay, so I just woke up, y'all. So we just gonna speed things up. What's going on right now with my life? Da da da. What I'm about to do? First of all, I can't find no like edge control. So I'm just put this wig like over because I ain't really tripping right now. But it's a cute wig though. Giving me drunk in love. So I'm doing my makeup um this morning. Where's the key to the safe? Need the cat code to the safe. Cut code to the safe. I'll show you how the neck work. Hold up, y'all. So, like I said, I was trying to turn this down. But I'm going to have my music in the background. So, let's hop into it. If I start forgetting stuff. I pop or anything. She said, she said, hey. So, let's get to the chaser. So, today's my last day in Charlotte. But it's today, like, November 6th. I have to go ahead and go to, um, Texas. I'm going to the beat. Hugh, go. Okay. Hey. I'm going to Houston. <laughs> That's why I said let me not get distracted. Because my mind going to be daddy, 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 yeah, yeah. My ex-girlfriend showed me this song, yeah. And I fell in love with it. Now every time I think of this song, I think of her. But she ain't shit, so. She ain't different. Nope. Let me start talking shit. But now, nah. ain't nothing for me in Charlotte, honestly. Like I said, I'm a fireball. I just want to branch out and try to see what works for me in the best way that I can. And I feel like, like I said, I'm in my prime right now, you know? No kids, no nothing. I'm blessed with all the grace of God. And I want to use the time and opportunity that I do have to go figure out who I am. And I feel like it's a learning lesson for all of us because it's like you can, we can all say we know who we are and all that extra stuff. But in reality, life has a way of reestablish, reestablishing us every single day. We learn something new. We become new with people through new lessons. And, you know, just a lot. And I feel like... The best we can do is take the information that betters us and that allows us to be the better versions of ourselves and use that information in the best way that we can for growth. And what I learned is when I go to other, you know, states, the ones on my bucket li list specifically, I feel like I achieve something because I go there not knowing nobody or nothing and walk away creating a whole good solution for myself or creating a name for myself within that time period of being wherever I'm in either if I'm booked or not because it's just like 
I want to be worldwide. I don't want to be local. I don't want to turn up my city. And I understand people be like, if you can turn up the city that you in, then you take you can take over any city. Yeah, that's true. But when your city is not working with you, I'll go to other cities and go turn them up so they can turn me up somewhere else. You know? I don't know if that makes sense or not. Because it's not really about being a whole turned up. It's really about the connections. And just making connections in the major cities can allow me to touch smaller cities to where I don't even have to be there. And I want to use my time wisely. Like I said, by the grace of God, I have no kid. I'm not, I'm not saying that's a bad thing. I'm just like, why should you keep saying that? I'm just saying, like, you know, you're driving. Somebody got you, girl. But by the grace of God, you know, I don't have anything that sets me back. I'm not saying that kids are set back on anything. I'm just saying for me specifically, because that's what I was worried about. I was like, I was worried about messing with these boys or, you know, and just my head not right. I was like, thank God none of these got me. So I got a chance to fight. <laughs> that's what I mean by that. So nobody take it out of content or in the wrong way, because I love kids. Kids are a blessing in their own way. They bring light to you. If you allow them to. I got my little sister Lima. I love her to death. And I don't want no kids until like I'm done being the woman that I need to become or even close to that woman at all. That's when I want kids, you know, or start a family. So let's go to the next conversation. Pack like, ooh, <laughs> But now, like I was saying, and my best bet is just to leave the right way which is just go because i try to tell people like i'm not sitting here debating but i feel in my heart fear and soul go i'm out it's like you're not gonna argue with me i'm not a very argumentative person i don't like to argue because i already got my mind made up it's a bad habit but it goes good in certain cases and scenarios when I use it the right way. Not in the wrong liability, you know, affirmation. Pack like. But yeah, like I was saying. And like I, I'm going to get everything that I need to get done. Like, my name is Monica Bowl. Well, I got. And I got got it. And by the grace of God, anything that I put my hands in, touch, or do. And the thing is, everybody, I want to act funny now. I just want they, like, karma's going to come. I'm not tripping at all. I am not tripping at all. Like, when you do people dirty, it's going to come back. And I wish a good cheek on all my enemies. Because they're going to feel it. Way before they even feel me. And then you're going to feel me. Which is the after effect. And they're going to learn. Because I'm not a revengeful person. I've been left revenge to God a long time ago. I told them, if you want to handle it, go crazy. Because I don't got the strength or energy to do it. People think that's like a weakness or something. Nah, fam. I'm just trying to save your ass. You know? Damn, I got quiet because I feel you, Queen. And as far as what's going on in my life right now, modeling, I took like a little break because it was too much. A girl like me and like I said if anybody know me or you ever came across from me I have no problem projecting my dreams like I'm telling you 
what's up or what I want, you know? And one thing that I want is I want to contribute back to, let me not say my dreams on here, is dream chasers, dream catchers, and dream destroyers. And y'all not about to, I'm just let y'all see it. I mean, I can talk about it a lot, babe, but no, I'm just let y'all see it through action. I can tell you what I want and so you can get a visual of it in my head. I'm not talking about everything. And for the most part, I'm still growing to become a woman I need to be. So I ain't really tripping off some stuff. Mom remember this video though, and I remember everything I said from it. And I want everybody to eat their words. For real, for real. And I'm a very I'm, it's very hard to come in contact with me, even talking wise, because I'm gonna keep changing my number for these motherfuckers that think they can just, you know, come in my life when they want to. But no, 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 Thing I hate in these worlds is disrespect for kids and motherfuckers that think they can just got one up on you in the name of love. I can suck my dick. All I care. But Queen said you can tag like no, I don't like it too much. It's really too much. I would rather be a Barbie doll and get dressed up and played with every day. No, you don't. Trust me. It's fun to a certain extent. Cause after the dress up is over, and you got nothing to else to dress over and start dressing up your personality then your lifestyle then you and I don't like that then I don't like the violent industry then you don't get upset then you don't want to cry we don't cry we don't do that no we don't <laughs> Bad bitch. Yeah. I need to go to Australia next. Because I know Australia been waiting for me. Y'all need a little piece of chocolate in y'all life. For me. And I look good. Pack life. Mm. She a fool. So I'm done. A very simple. I'm gonna let y'all see it from this angle. I want y'all to see it back though. I need to mind your business. <laughs> Cause I go to Texas today. But now, um, that's the face I'm giving this morning. What's up, Lee? See the frog? Nah, it's gonna have to be light. She a fool under the...